you guys, what's going on? I'm David, I'm your Chef David. Tonight, let's make basil shrimp. So, main ingredient right here guys, basil, okay? All you need is the leaf, you don't need the stem. And for the vegetable, bell pepper, yellow onion, green onion, ginger, add chili if you like. So I got the Thai chili and the serrano chili pepper. And the shrimp, this is the orange shrimp, 15 piece right here. A couple garlic. All right, so let's get it on. So let's start off with a bell pepper. Only half a bell pepper, that's all you need. Yellow onion, you wanna break this apart. Take the inside out. I got two pieces of garlic, smash it a little bit. Now the Thai chili, don't cut it too small. You wanna be able to see it. Now the ginger. Serrano. Now the green end, just the end part for now. All right guys, you good? All right, next will be the Thai basil. Okay, like I say, you only need the leaf, you don't need the stem. So you wanna just pick it like that. Okay, very simple. Facebook, look for Chef David Su, H-S-U. A lot of time I don't post on YouTube, but I will do a quick video, a fast recipe on my Facebook page, guys. Basil is a very unique vegetable. They have a very good smell here. Vietnamese, Taiwanese, Thai, a lot of Southeast Asia country, they eat a lot of basil. This goes very well in the soup too. All right, guys. Okay, next, let's make the sauce, the, the shrimp basil sauce. You would need a half cup of fresh water, or you can use the chicken stock. No flavor though. Tablespoon, regular soy sauce, one tablespoon. And the dark soy sauce, half a tablespoon, guys. Now this is cooking wine, sauching cooking wine, one tablespoon. This is the chicken base stock. If you don't have this, you can use MSG. If you don't have it, just leave it out if you want, all right? One teaspoon. Okay, now this is a sugar, tablespoon. You're gonna need one tablespoon of a sugar. White pepper powder, quarter teaspoon. Now this is a quarter teaspoon sesame oil. All right, now cherry oil is optional because you don't, you don't need to add this. It might be too spicy for you guys, okay? Because I got two kinds of chili going there. But for me, I'm going to add a one teaspoon of our chili oil. Sichuan chili oil. If you want to know how to make this, go to my channel. I do have a video uh, show you guys how to make this. They're very simple and very easy. So now we're gonna mix it up. It's your sauce right here. I have teaspoon. Two teaspoons of a cornstarch. You're gonna need water. Tablespoon. Two tablespoons of a water. So this is the sauce right here, all right? And you got your cornstarch. Okay, next step, let's cook the shrimp. And now look, vegetable oil. Now you're gonna wait for the oil to get hot before you put your shrimp in, all right? cook this like medium. You don't want to overcook this, okay? Shrimp is marinated. I marinated the shrimp with just the chicken white, cornstarch, and oil. I will attach the link that show you how to uh, marinate the shrimp. I'm gonna remove this. Add a little bit more oil. First thing that's gonna go to be the ginger and the garlic. Ginger, garlic, and the chopped green onion. The chili pepper, don't put it in yet. They'll get real, real spicy. Now, the bell pepper. And the onion. Now, you see the little bit green onion? Save that for the end, okay? Right now, you want to put the bell pepper and the onion. You want to brown the onion.
gonna set up, I'm gonna fry it. it up before you put it in, okay? Let the sauce boil. It's almost done, guys. Making Chinese food very fast. Especially if you cook it in a restaurant. It will be very hard to teach you guys how to cook if I was making this dish in a restaurant. Because the flame. See this? How small that is? But you know I have the people that tell me in other country they don't have the gas stove that like the one that I have in the restaurant. So I'll put the shrimp in guys. Now the basil guys, put the basil in. Presentation. If you like, you can add some red pepper, like red bell pepper. That will make this dish look real good, so, which I don't have it today. So that's one of the reason I add the uh, Thai chili. Here. If you like that gravy that you can go over your rice, then don't put too much cornstarch in. But if you want this dish to look real pretty, then you don't want too too soupy, you know? So just like that. Just like what I'm showing you guys right now. Here we go guys. So lay down your food, right? You're gonna put a lot of shrimp on top. Especially if you're making this in a restaurant. Guys, take a look. Thai basil shrimp. Because the camera reason, that's why it look kind of dark, but actually they're not dark. Hey guys, thanks for watching my channel. Take a look, my Thai basil shrimp. Thanks you guys, and I'll see you guys very soon.